Hello, my name is Henry, Henry Mancera and this is CCD Editorials. This agreement is when two or more people dispute over a topic on whether it is just or unjust. If one wishes to represent their view on an idea, they must be able to support their view. Without specific examples of information to back up your opinion, it is like never picking a side in the first place. Although disagreement draws the line on what people think is right or wrong, it results in better, better decision making than if disagreement was to be avoided. The book A Child Called It by David Pelzer and The Pack by Samson Davis from Metcont and George Jenkins portray this idea. In the book, um, a, child called it, David's a Child Called It, David's parents fight on whether or not the punishments his mother gives him are too severe. All the fighting between the parents leads to the father coming home from work later than usual and sometimes coming home very late and drunk. He, do he does this to avoid his wife, who is bound to say something to, that, that would have started the fight. This results in the parent, parents deciding to divorce, leaving, leaving David with his mother and open to any punishments at any level of craziness. In the book, The Pack, Sam and Remek argue on whether or not they should drop out of college and become full-time rappers. Remek supports dropping out of college to become full-time rappers because he says that they have potential and one record producer already likes one of their raps, which means they can get a lot of money, which was the whole purpose of becoming rappers. Sam agrees on the fact that becoming rappers was to obtain some money, but to him, the money was to be used to help him get through college. He says that saying, they're, saying that they're this far in school and that they should not waste all, all this time, effort, and money they put into it. Eventually, they decided to both stay in college. As, as, a, result, as a result of their decision, they became wealth, wealthy and famous doctors who loved their jobs. People who try to avoid disagreement will not make decisions as good as people who have, encouraged this, who have encountered disagreement. People will try to avoid disagreement when they don't even notice. For example, usually in school, if one prefers a, prefers a particular brand, brand of shoes, but everyone else in school is wearing the, this other brand, one will follow the crowd so he can fit in. One might not know, but if by wearing the brand of shoes that everyone else is wearing, he's avoiding disagreement by not wearing the shoe he prefers. When you grow up, will you be a follower?